Hey, what's up guys, it's the game Res, and if you're watching this video, you have probably been wondering on how to upload your NFT collection on uh, OpenSea, or there are also other sites where you can upload it, but uh, OpenSea is the most used one, and I think the most profitable one, but how to upload your NFT collection on OpenSea automatically, because now uh, you can uh, only upload it one by one, so you'll be doing it for ages, and especially if you're having a collection from uh, of uh, 10,000 uh, pieces, that's never going to happen. You will need probably like four years to upload it hand by hand and uh, one after another. So uh, in this video, I will show you how to upload it automatically so you can do whatever you want uh, while the program will upload it. And by the way, guys, if you're also wondering and searching for a tutorial on how to Photoshop NFTs or how to random generate them, there's also a tutorial on this channel. So if you want to check it out, there will be a link in the description of the video. So let's get to the tutorial. The first thing that you need to do is download the program called Minnie Mouse Macro. This is a program that basically automatically does every single thing in a loop and uh, you can use it for multiple things, but we are going to use it for the upload of NFT collection and uh, basically go ahead and download it. I will leave the link in the description of the video, but you can also just Google for it and you'll find the same thing. To achieve an automatically uploaded uh, NFT collection, you have to have Excel on your PC. But if you do not, that's not really a big problem. You can go ahead and Google for it and uh, just open Excel online. Uh, you have to open two folders for this. Also go ahead and open the Minnie Mouse macro uh, program because that's basically uh, the thing that does everything. So the footage I made earlier was a little bit unclear. So I decided to make some new footage. And as you can see, if you log in on OpenSea, you go to create, you can decide which one you're going to make. You can create a new collection. And you can basically decide to pick, uh, put pictures. If you want, you can Photoshop it by yourself. In the first tutorial I made, it's pretty clear how to Photoshop and how to do everything. So the size is already set on uh, OpenSea. So you can upload the pictures, you can upload the name. For example, uh, we can do test. Test, test, uh, you can add everything you want and basically choose which one. Ethereum is going to cost you some money because it's uh, Ethereum blockchain has uh, pretty, pretty high uh, gas fees. Polygon is free, so you can choose for Polygon and as much tokens as you want because people will be able to pay with these and decide which one, how you want it to, uh, to be presented. So which team to be displayed and I decided but it's not your yeah, name test club res because some names are already uh, yeah this name is available and I need something else yeah the picture so I already have the NFTs ready I have uh, ready NFTs and we'll go for President Putin club and NFT ready images and this is it so I'll just go for this one and you also need to name logo description oh the fees let's put like 10 fees and you have to put your meta mask address so put it in there create your collection name is too similar to that of an existing collection well Let's do the gaming res club. That's not similar though, I think, at least. Yeah, name is available, create. It's created, nice, the gaming res club, yes. So basically what you need to do, and as I already said, you have to open up the Excel files. Oh, that's wrong. And because this is a test, I'm not going to do like with new NFTs or anything. So you have to open up two NFT, uh, two Excel files. One will be for the description that you want to put. And for maybe if you want to add, uh, for example, you can add properties. So character name, etc, etc, levels, speed, power. I I'm not sure you can uh, do unlockable content. For example, if you're selling like... Um, a movable uh, pixel NFT you can just put a link to it so that they can download it things like that you can basically choose whatever you want and uh, this is basically pretty much how you do it just hand by hand uh, one by one you do it but we don't want to do that because that's that will take a lot of time so 
for example, choose the in one Excel file you put the file name and name of the thing of the NFT. File name is probably going to be one, and then two, and it depends on how many NFTs you have. But you can just go ahead and swipe it to like I did it to 245 or 46. Uh, you can go ahead and do the file name. So for me, it will be president president hashtag one and then president hashtag two so you can go ahead and just go down and we'll do the same thing so that's pretty easy uh select number one that's already done so don't click on this nft or uh, on this excel file. <laughs> i keep saying nft but it's excel folder mini mouse and for example here this will be the description so i'll put in you can go ahead and this will be the description. So, President Club Club is made by by Res. It's an NFT collection of I don't know of ten thousand ten thousand sexy Putin Putin NFT NFTs. This this will be my description. Uh, you can also, as I already said, you can also add like level of speed, things, things you want to put in the NFT, but it will take a little bit longer for you to do that. So mini mouse macro, we open mini mouse macro and there will be a couple of things you need to see in there and do in there. You basically have to create a loop for it to work. And this, this is the loop, as you can see, you can uh, enter infinite or just loop for infinite. But if you want, if you have like 100 NFTs, 100 NFTs, make sure it's selected and it will keep doing the same thing in the loop for 100 times. So the thing is you have to make a good loop that does the same thing. So you have to have to record, record, as you can see, the first thing is add item. Click on here, it's already selected. Copy it with Ctrl C, go to the right, click on here, click on this, paste it, click on PNG, open. And now you go to, again, to the Excel folder, you copy it, go to the bottom, go to the left. So it's already selected for, this next, uh, for the next uh, PNG, uh, for the next uh, <laughs> NFT, I mean. And you can't actually scroll, so you have to go with the tab button downstairs uh, to, to the bottom. Now you click on here, click on here, select, click on here, go, go to the bottom. It's the tick club is the gaming rest club is already selected. You go to the bottom and then you go on create. Give it some time. You can actually the faster you do this, the, the faster it's going uh, to go uh, uh, on the open sea side. Click it, the gaming rest club and then stop. And the last one is, as you can see, the last one is the left click down. So this is the left click down on here. Go ahead and delete it. And this is pretty much your loop. And the faster you do it, as I, as I just said, the faster you do it, the faster it's go, gonna go and upload it. And uh, But make sure at the last part when it's loading, because some NFTs are loading a little bit longer, some a little bit shorter, just give it, at, at that moment, just give it a little bit more space to, uh, to load the NFT. And as you can see, if you're done with this, you can go ahead and click on play macro. And as you can see, I'm not doing anything with the mouse, but it's actually automatically uploading the nfts and by the way you can ju just choose for it's just uh, it's really simple you can choose for for example i'm clicking on the i'm uh, pasting the two and then the png clicking on the png because if you're just gonna go enter and it it won't save but uh actually if you're um if you want you can also just type in png after the after the ctrl c or uh, control feed after pasting it in there you can just type in png and it will do the same thing and uh, the most important thing you can't really scroll with your mouse you can that's that's not gonna work because it can't remember what you're scrolling or what you're doing so with tab you go downstairs and just create as you can see and hey you created president number two and at this moment give it some time just close it go to the club and it's doing the same thing all over and because the excel file is going down to the right first so i started with one and when you copy it just go to the right so it's set up already for the next one 
PNG as you can see, upload, Excel file again, you already can copy it, go down, go to the left. So basically it's one loop all over, you can choose uh, different loops and different uh, like for example selecting it and things like that but you have to think about it. This one I already like made my, <laughs> made, my, made, uh, made it by myself in my mind so go to the right, go to the bottom, left and it's uh, it's really easy it's it keeps on working it keeps on working and you, as just as i already said you can do it for property stats level everything like that so this is really easy and it will uh, go ahead and upload the faster you do this loop the faster it's going it's going to work and going to upload the nfts so the less time it will take to upload the full nft collection but as you can see this will take some time so you can go ahead to go to your work to go to the gym or things like that and uh, it will still still keep going. And right now, go back the gaming rest club items. It uh, needs some time to upload it. So as you can see, a couple of items in there, but it says one item, so it will need some time. And for select or for selling them, it's the same way. Just uh, you can use the same program and sell them. And as you can see, details about the you can put some yeah. I did test <laughs> while creating the collection but you can put something else and uh, yeah it will be up there and obviously make a nice Twitter account or Instagram account just promote it but to be honest guys if you're really expecting to get rich overnight by doing NFTs yeah you have to probably have like a really good NFT collection and people just yeah just going crazy about it for example let's take Crypto Hasbulla. I've seen that they uploaded uh, not that long ago and it's actually uh, started uh, going up really fast 159 ethereum <laughs> and as you can see these NFTs are really funny and it's uh, the actual Hasbulla but in many forms so uh, there is uh, he has a lot of clout so uh, yeah a lot of people are buying it Let's click on this for example and as you can see that that's a lot that's like two thousand almost two thousand uh, dollars so and it was yeah it's sold one time 16 hours ago actually yeah. so people are going uh pretty crazy about this Hasbulla. what what does it say hash oh no it disappeared oh here no it's not hash i think it's like his Hasbulla sign I thought it was hash, <laughs> but also almost uh, almost two thousand bucks. So, owner eighteen C, unnamed. Yeah, that's mm, created. Oh yeah, this is the owner basically of the N NFT. Yeah, for a second I thought it was created by that guy. But yeah, if you're if you have a lot of clout, it will be really easy to sell NFTs. Or for example, pixel, pixel, uh, pixel NFTs moving uh, nfts are really going yeah as you can see 745 and they are being sold for i see a lot of them for 0 0.018 so let's click on it and see yeah that's that's like 60 yeah almost 60 dollars but as you can see some of them are really cheap and some of them were 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 high to low yeah yeah, that's crazy. 8,000 Ethereum. No one's gonna... Yeah, as you can see, it was sold for 0 0.12 and someone is already trying to sell it for eight, for 33 million dollars and a half dollars. So yeah, that's that's just probably someone memeing or someone just putting it up. No one is actually for 2069. Nice. <laughs> I think this one has uh, more chance uh, to be bought by someone. So this was it for today guys, if you enjoyed the video and uh, the tutorial actually helped you out, don't forget to smash the like button, if you didn't then yeah, go ahead and dislike it. This was it for today, I hope you have a great day, great week or great year because 2022 is around the corner and uh, yeah, bye bye.